Consumer alert tonight for parents of little ones. Just last week, the Consumer Product Safety Commission called for a ban in sales on all inclined baby sleepers. And the popular product has been linked to at least 64 infant deaths. And now, as Channel 4 Stacey Spanos found out, a new investigation finds another sleeping device parents may be using may not be so safe either. Many parents believe a device like this called an in-bed sleeper is safer because it carves out a space for the baby when you put it in the bed with you. But a Consumer Reports investigation finds at least 12 babies have died while in sleepers like this. Consumer Reports crunched the data from 2012 and 2018. They found three babies died in the Baby Delight Snuggle Nest Infant Sleeper, which has sidewalls of mesh and fabric. Two deaths involved the Swaddle Me By Your Side sleeper, which has a flat mattress and low mesh sidewalls. And two deaths involved the Docatot, which is pillow-like and has a soft side bumper. Consumer Reports found five additional deaths linked to unidentified in-bed sleepers. In some of the deaths, an independent medical examiner concluded the in-bed sleeper was not a contributing factor to the child's death. Still, Consumer Reports safety experts believe that none of these products have been adequately safety tested and none adhere to safe sleep recommendations from the American Academy of Pediatrics and other health agencies. They also encourage bed sharing, a practice that in itself increases the risk of infant death. Bottom line, experts say always put babies to sleep in a bassinet, crib, play yard, or bedside sleeper with no padded sides or blankets and on the baby's back. And if you are sleep deprived and desperate, call your pediatrician and ask for help. Stacey Spanos, Channel 4, The Local Station.